integral of cot x dx or sec x dx. Today we will start some more questions of these types. Let's start with question number one. Integral of dx upon square root of one minus cos of two x. Now we have the formula for cos two x. That is one minus two sine square x. Cos of two x is one minus two sine square x. So. From here we can find the value of 1 minus cos 2x that is 2 sin square x dx upon square root of 2 sin square x. 1 upon square root of 2 is constant. Square and square root will be cancelled out. 1 upon sin. 1 upon sin is equal to cosec x. And what is the integral of cosec x? Integral of cosec is log of tan x by 2. Log of tan x by 2 plus c. Now the second question is integral of 1 plus cos of x square root. Now we know cos 2x is 1 minus 2 sin square x or 2 cos square x minus 1. So here we use the formula cos 2x as cos of 2x is 2 cos square x minus 1. 1 plus cos 2x is 2 cos square x because angle is half here so we will divide here the angle by 2. 2 cos square x by 2. 2 dx upon 2 cos square x y 2. Square root of 2 is constant. Square and square root will be cancelled out. Cos x y 2. And 1 upon cos is equal to sec of x y 2. Integral of sec x is log of tan pi by 4 plus x y 2. Here the angle is already x y 2. So we divide this angle by 2, x by 4. And here angle is x by 2. So we divide the denominator by 1 by 2. 2 upon root 2 log of 10 pi by 4 plus x by 4 plus c. Now we will use the formula a upon square root of a is equal to square root of a log of 10 pi by 4 plus x by 4 plus c. Square root of 2 log of 10 pi by 4 plus x by 4 plus c. Next is integral of square root of 1 plus cos 2x and 1 minus cos 2x. We know 1 plus cos 2x is equal to 2 cos square x. Apply the formula here. 2 cos square x upon 2 sin square x. Cos upon sin is cot. Square and square root will be cancelled out. Cot x. And what is the integral of cot is log of sin x plus c.
1 minus cos of x, 1 plus cos of x, dx. We know the formula for cos 2x is 1 minus 2 sin square x cos 2x. 1 minus cos of 2x is equals to 2 sin square x. When angle becomes half is 2 sin square x by 2. And the another formula for cos 2x is 2 cos square x minus 1. 1 plus cos of 2x is equals to 2 cos square x. And 1 plus cos x is 2 cos square x by 2. Apply this formula here. 1 minus cos x is 2 sin square x by 2 upon 2 cos square x by 2. 2 and 2 cancel out. Sin upon cos is tan. Square and square root will be cancelled. And integral of tan is minus log of cos x. x here is x by 2. So we will divide it by half. What we get is minus 2 log of cos x by 2 plus c. Now the next question is integral of tan 2x, tan 3x, tan 5x, dx. We can write 5x as 2x plus 3x. Now here we apply the formula for tan of a plus b. Tan a plus b is equals to tan of a plus tan of b 1 minus tan a tan b. We will apply this formula here. tan 2x plus 3x tan of a plus tan of b 1 minus tan a tan b. Now cross multiply it. 1 into tan 5x is tan 5x minus tan 2x tan 3x tan 5x is equals to tan of 2x plus tan of 3x. Now tan 5x minus tan 2x left side pe liyayenge in terms ko and tan 2x tan 3x tan 5x. Ye humare paas given interval tha given integral me term thi iski value humare paas c a gai. So we will put this in the given integral Integral of tan of 5x minus tan 2x minus tan 3x dx. Now apply the formula. Integral of tan is log of sec. Log sec 5x upon 5 minus log of sec 2x upon 2 minus log of sec 3x upon 3 plus c.
Now the next question is integral of sine of x minus a upon sine of x minus b. Now in the denominator we have the term x minus b. So we will add and subtract b in the numerator. x minus b minus a plus b upon sine of x minus b dx. Take x minus b as one term. And b minus a as the other. Now we will apply the formula here. Sine a plus b. Sine of a plus b. That is equals to sine a cos b. Plus cos a sine b. Apply this formula here. Write the numerator as sin x minus b plus b minus a. Now apply the formula sin a cos b plus cos of a and sin of b. And in the denominator we have sin of x minus b. x minus b sin will be cancelled out here. Cos of b minus a is constant. Integral of 1 dx plus sin of b minus a is constant. And cos upon sin is equals to cot. Now apply the formula here. Integral of 1 is x. x cos of b minus a plus sin of b minus a. And integral of cot is log of sin log of sin x minus b plus c. Now the next question is integral of sin x minus alpha upon sin x plus alpha. Now in the denominator we have x plus alpha. So we add and subtract alpha in the numerator. Now we will apply the formula for sin of a minus b. sin a cos b minus cos a sin b sin a cos b minus cos of a sin b sin will be cancelled here cos 2 alpha is constant integral of 1 dx sin 2 alpha is constant and cos upon sin is cot x cos 2 alpha integral of cot is log of sin 